So over the years, I'm not going to argue that if there are churches no who want to tax, I'm the state. If you switch my daddy, and yes, the churches no who want to tax because uh, we share schools now. They are almost the same state now. I'm more bored, I'm more modern. If you switch my, what about almost all modern church no are business no? So they should pay tax. Now, Doctor Muhammadu Bawumiya, NPP, I'm a flag bearer for 2024 elections. Or no, I'm not going to be going to cap. Bawumiya, I can't send me after they will be making you turn ABC. Oh. Ni ba umiye kano eno ano no ebi suche ma uh huh ya be ko in semene mo into details mashawa so be share video we midi edit kojo black cosmetic product ba kong ena mero komende ama uyo biya opesa oko ko e toso na utun tun su e na hana ha omo omo di product we mo dance ya di be brina omo wa ne serum facial cream soap any afi body lotion uo U S no pe bi e yisua e free shipping uo other country swa be bi kitu ebi ne obetu ya for shipping ne ne dia wansa a kong klo iki product eno iti mashawa. Number if you go away screen is from Naji Uklo UK product. So last week, Dr. Muhammadu Kojo Baumia. I oh, so your man day born. Last week, Mohono Okopie Mu Ewa Bono region. Now, Baumia Miti Eye clergy members no and a Baumio de two winnings. Oh, well, who debate be a air cost or say a man for BCO? A bear churches in Omuntia tax. A business churches in Momuntia. Now, on no Baumia de way a yeni opinion. Mashrawa, Tiasma Baumia, Kai. Church and taxes. Are we going to tax churches? My view on this is simple. In fact, that's why I say that if you share a Juma church, in fact, we should rather be paying them rather than they paying us. Unless you don't understand the work the church has done. If you're looking at the buildings, the the, the way they try to keep the society together, the, church, the universities, the hospitals, the schools, it's massive. It's just massive. Many churches have hundreds of schools. Massive. So I don't see and I will not have a situation where we are taxing the churches. We rather want to give churches incentives to support what government is doing. I want us to be partners. Uh, in, in the way that the development partners are with us, you are our domestic development partners, and we will give you incentives to do more. So, where your doctor Bawumian view or say churches and yes, your taxi or number mono, we should rather pay them, and I say we should give them incentives because of a yeguma son, and I say yeguma papa or more ye ewagan hano. Now, Andra and a doctor Muhammad Bawumia okopie mu ewo northeast. Ah, on the ensemble kotuga on the same argument whether ni oka ya no ojine baby ojine na anasa oba kya se. I want a doctor Muhammad ba wumi asi. Oh, science someone oka ya no. These are not my words. Listen. I believe, and I said this the other day when I was, I think in Bono region or so, um, when I met the clergy. I said that the church is one is, is the foremost development partner of government. Is the foremost development partner of government. The church and faith-based organizations. Why do I say so? You look at the number of schools the churches have built. Look at the number of hospitals the churches have built. Look at the number of universities the churches have built and the faith-based organizations have built. Look at the number of people the churches and faith-based organizations take care of on a daily basis. Can you imagine, just take a thought for a moment, that you wake up tomorrow and all the schools, universities, and hospitals the churches have built disappear. They just disappear. How would Ghana be like? Ghana will collapse, isn't it? it, will, it will, we, will not, we will not survive in, in this sort of situation because there will be chaos, you see. So at that point, I was uh, joking. And I said, oh, people are talking about taxing churches. I don't, I don't believe, and we will not tax churches. Because if you look at 
the work the churches uh, they have done. Then I was joking. Then maybe we should have actually paid them for what they did, not really trying to tax them. But I wasn't really saying we should pay churches. No, I'm saying that we should give incentives to churches to do more. When we talk about our external development partners, we are giving them all sorts of import exemptions. But when we talk about our internal development partners like the churches or faith-based institutions, we don't give them any exemptions. But they do more in terms of development than many of our external development partners. So I'm saying that we should do more in the area of in incentives such as tax exemptions uh, on, on, on import duties when you are coming in to build hospitals or schools and so on to, to support the churches and the other faith-based organizations because they are supporting government. And that is why I made that point. And I want that relationship, and I call it a golden age between the church and the state because the church has so many intellectuals and we need to get closer across the faith-based organizations and so on, and we can speak a lot about values in our society, the lack of which causes us problems. And we can start discussing these right from primary school and so on. And so that's, that's the sort of relationship I want us to, to have with the church, to have a discussion on the management of our schools and so on, which they have a lot of things to do in them. Doctor Baumia clarification we know the about Bontiu. I'll know the old chum say. Science and more kind say we should rather pay churches instead of taxing them. No, science and more kind of he was joking. Number one, paying in our canoe, it was in a form of ABR, Asorno, or Bayer School, ABR, what top equipment in a JB or outside or the BPM or Ghana. I was say. A year state, no, a so masni, no more, more sa tax exemptions, Nadia, no, I omu ye taxes, Nadia, no, if you were more, more, sonny, be ya, be motivated churches, no, to do more. Now, I don't know, social media, yes, Ghanaians need be or more reacted. I said this, in fact, I was watching the section on Facebook Live, and doctor never promised to pay churches. Hey, are you sure? Some of the first video, no, what they say, we should rather be paying churches instead of taxing them. I am not taking him seriously again. What if he wins and later says all the campaign promises were a joke? Now, the next person was said, after receiving the steering, you see the kind of rough driving you are practicing. So you brought the clergy together only to joke in their presence. Nah, this man is not serious. Joking, I uh, only the other question mark. Ah, since you are no clergy, no. You name almost time since you are. Into my mom, we say, but we mean in our ayakwa anasa day. But but we mean. Yes, I'm not clarify also. Oh, yes, I incentives and I say paying the churches now or can you know? And then they say, Oh, yeah, pay tickets and I say Methodist or move a project be our Ghana. Yes, I was say I'm more tax exemptions. No, no, dear, to me, hey, hey, I'm no more your development in the baby. I'm Ghana, but science, I'm more kind of a bit of what they are. he was joking. Then I'm a future, but I'm not going to be on the road. Since they see, I know incentive pattern also, no, a joke and I said, then it was young. Show out your mommy or comment section for me. The Eddie Kojo Black. My show also be following him on all social media platforms Facebook, uh, Trends GS, also and a website uh, www.trendsghnews.com. Makramu. Sending money abroad just got a whole lot easier with AfriX. Our slick app makes international transfer crazy fast and super secure. Just tap a few buttons, money sent across the board in a minute. One magic of AfriX is that you can add your debit card or load money to your AfriX wallet right in the app. Then send those funds to your recipient overseas straight to their bank account at lightning speed and zero fees. You can earn a one-time bonus of $20 if you refer your friends and they send up to $150. Whether you're in the USA, Canada, Europe or anywhere in the world, AfriX. Best rates at no cost with no hidden fees.